Fox represents all my island people say We people celebrating early from my homeland Like my old man say, there's nothing impossible So we have to bring this message to my brother Lyrical Straight from the crew, out to the blue We represent the voices of my ancestors calling And I was getting more than my culture is falling Now we have a step up for the past 20 scholars Once there no was a stop, ain't nobody gonna stop us People, everybody, would you listen to us for a start? No boy complaining, and that's we partaking We represent the fall the ones falling, we resemble true art When we bust the line, flip the rabbits from the heart No, there's never gonna be another Everybody's not Previously on Delos We set out on our first cruise of the Andaman Islands Bubs gets inked by a squid And the boys go fishing The moon looks like a sun. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. We left the anchorage and there's like nine knots of breeze, so we're able to sail. Turn the motor off. We've got all the sails up and we're doing like five knots in the right direction. It's beautiful, full moon. I got my cup of rum with some tea. That's what it's all about. Sailing into the full moon to a volcanic island. <laughs> <laughs> the last few days have been awesome. When we sailed from Thailand to to here, to Andamans, the sea was it wasn't rough, but for me it was still kind of, you know, you had to get uh, used to how the sea was like very rolly and stuff. Um, but now it's so calm and we're still going five knots, so for me this is perfect. And we have a full moon. You can have a cup of tea and just enjoy it. It's really nice. And we're going to Volcano! <laughs> <laughs> Good morning everybody, it is 3.30 in the morning and the conditions for our sail east to Barren Island is pretty much near perfect. It doesn't really feel like we're going upwind at all. <laughs> Boat's hardly heeled over and the ocean is super flat and super calm. Um, the full moon's out so that makes everything much more pleasant. Um, yeah, so everyone's real cozy down in their bunk, sleeping well, and makes a nice night watch for us out here. Hello everyone, Bubbles here. First time doing a night watch log, which is exciting. <laughs> We're about two hours away now from Barrel Island, which is really exciting. First time to see a live volcano, so I'm really happy about that. Loving it, it's just perfect. I like sailing a lot. So, yeah, the the Andaman Islands are pretty remote to start with, and not a lot of people come here. And Barren Island is a live volcano, like kind of removed from the Andaman Islands, so even less people come here. And it's it's a pretty special spot because it's really deep water, and then the volcano just comes up from like 2,000 meters of depth. So usually when you get something like that, there's really good sea life and marine life around it, and really cool diving topography because there's like big underwater cliffs. So that's kind of what I'm hoping for. Oh shit. So, um, and there's nobody here. It's just, it's like 50 miles off the coast of the Edina Islands and like about 350 miles from Burma on one side and Thailand on the other side. So it's just kind of in the middle of the Andaman Sea. And it should be sweet. Ready? <laughs> Morning. <laughs> Morning. Do you want to come up and uh, 
check out the Barren Island. Oh, it's a volcano. Yeah, it's a jewel of the sea. Oh, fuck. Man, so this place is really crazy. Like the water is so deep. So we're just gonna go ahead and drop now in like, we're in about 30 meters of water. And we'll drop the hook. And then once the sun comes up a bit more vertical and we have a better view, I think we're gonna try and come into this. There's like a big cove right here where the lava flow is. Look good to you. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and drop here, bro. I don't know, I just walked out here. I'm like, holy fuck, there's a volcano. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Us girls, we just woke up and the guys are just like fixing and anchors out, you know. It's really, really cool though. Whoa. <clears throat> so because it's so deep here, we're gonna, um, Brady and I are gonna go on the dinghy with the stern anchor and dingy over to the rocks over there where there's more of like a deeper kind of channel-y bit. Set the anchor and then you guys are gonna back the boat down and then we'll pass the line up and stern tie. So then hopefully we'll be a bit closer in and still have a cool view of the volcano and be bowing to the swell, so we'll see how we sit. Just in case you didn't catch that, here's the plan. Yoshirama and the Braidster will take our spare anchor out in Maggie and drop it really close to the volcano. We'll then pull Delos towards the shore, setting our main anchor on the cliffs below in the process. This is the uh, Delos, Delos, over. Station calling Port Blair. Yeah, Port Blair, this is the yacht Delos with our uh, position report for the morning, over. Yeah, confirm the uh, name of the ship. Uh, name of the ship is Delos, Delta, Echo, Lima, Oscar, Sierra, over. Okay, sending us Delos. 
Good morning, go ahead. Good morning to you. We are now anchored on the west side of Barren Island. Coordinates as follows. 12 degrees, 16 decimal, 97 north. 93 degrees, 50 decimal, 84 east, over. Confirm how long uh, will, uh, will you will stay there? Uh, we will be anchored in this uh, location for two more days, over. Yeah, two more days, over. Yes, sir, that is correct. Uh, next port will be Mayan Bundar, over. Uh, please spell out. Mike, Yankee, Alpha, November, Bravo, Uniform, November, Delta, Alpha, Romeo, over. Okay, next port will be Maya Bandar after two days. Okay, comfortable. Thank you. Keep in touch with the Port Blair Port Radio. We will. Have a great day, sir. Goodbye. Okay, bye. Good day. With the butter chicken bureaucracy advised of our current whereabouts, we decided it was time. Time to get in the water and do some exploring. What do you feel most excited about, Bri? Manta race at a volcano. It's just cool, man. Good diving, clear water, deep drop-offs, big fish. It's good. So I haven't dived for a while. So right now I'm checking some charts, the recreational dive planner to refresh my memory from uh, dive stops and stuff since I don't have a dive watch, which all the other ones have. I'm a bit old school. And I'm very excited. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be great to see the manta rays. Okay. I already saw a manta ray actually when I snorkeled, but like it's gonna be sweet. Yes, <laughs> So all the guys, they are, they've gone diving, so they're going to be down for 40 minutes and we, me and Babs, we are going snorkeling because Max saw Mantra just over there. So we want to see some too. We're really excited. And we got a camera. Yeah. It's going to be fucking awesome. <laughs> we go crazy with the camera when they go. Yeah, we're like, woohoo. <laughs> first order of business was to check our anchor chain, making sure it was laid out nicely and not snagged on any volcanic bits.
we ended up racing Maggie around to different sites, dropping the hook and diving all week long. We didn't see any manta rays, but the drop-offs were awesome and the water was alive with a crazy amount of species. Bubs even got into the mix with their first underwater breathing lesson. an Endeman Island diver. <laughs> Woohoo! It's pretty sweet to learn how to dive. I'm like, there's a volcano erupting in the background and there's <laughs> black sand. Like, it's pretty cool. It was awesome. And Brady are the best things in the world. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Oh, that's nice. Oh, okay. So did you uh, catch an effect? I guess oh, one. Oh fuck, we caught one. Yeah. You did? Yeah, a small one. I threw it back though. It was like last time. But uh, we were killed by the tunas. I think it was tunas. Like for, I was untangling this shit because I cast one before and I reeled it all into the boat. Yeah. Uh, and then I'm doing that. I'm just sitting there and it just hits Brian. It's like <laughs> Hits on big, the surface. Big, big really big fish. And then I'm like and it just hits me too. So I have one too. And I think you guys are so excited. Look, look, look at this lure. Look at it, like lure. it's this one is it's fucking snapped off. Look at this. All of the three hooks on this Take one. Off. Yeah. So this one has one hook left out of three. That one has none. And look at the bite marks. Yeah, three to check it's like out. The big fucking tuna, huh? Just destroyed. But it's just the, gone. It's gone. Yeah. Well, I don't know if it's tuna, but most likely it's because they school. Or yeah. it could have been mahi. Got it. <laughs> it's really craving a tuna steak. Yeah. I know. It's coming close though. Yeah. Like this is us getting our fishing game up. We get yeah. destroyed. And we get our ship broken and we lose all these fish and then we're like, alright, no, we're fucking around. Now we're fucking yeah. game, motherfuckers! Then we pull out the monster hooks and the yeah. fucking line and we, and we yeah, yeah. It's, it's almost there. We're, right. we're slowly nice getting close. <laughs> what is it? I think that we got. Oh, <laughs> titties out! Titties are out! <laughs> you guys are doing it, so I thought I would join. That's alright. I got excellent blurring software. Sweet. You got a fish? Monscraft! Victory? Yeah! Woohoo! Everybody's so I don't excited. need to cook dinner. I don't need to cook dinner. You still need to cook, mate. You still need to cook, it's oh. just fish now. <laughs> we'll make stir fry with the fish. If it's tuna, let's do big tuna steak. Whoa! Whoa! Look at that! What is that? That's a massive snapper. Yeah. That's delicious. Who caught it? Great stir. Which lure? On Rajneesh the head wobbler. Rajneesh the head wobbler. Get all these titties down. Oh. The head is like at least two kilos. Do you guys feel victorious? Yeah. It was really good. Did you just catch it just then? Yeah, just out here. We, we dragged it around for a while.
say Now you do me Hey man That's a big one. Oh, look at that guy. I think he's a massive snapper, bro. Alright. I think we've come to the conclusion that it's a snapper. It's similar to a red Pacific snapper, but it's Indian Ocean snapper, obviously. And we don't have any fish books on the Indian Ocean, so... We're gonna call it an Indian Ocean Snapper. The problem is, we don't really know what the fuck we mean. <laughs> <laughs> We're real good at catching pelagics, like you know, tuna and mahi, and taking care of those and filleting them. But these guys with scales, it's not what we're used to doing. So I thought, okay, well, let's just skin it before we fillet it. I tried that bit. With smaller ones, I know you can descale them by scraping the scales off. But I think we're gonna, we don't have a sharp enough knife. We're pretty, um, what's the word? Ill prepared. So this is the side we already did? Whoa. I think we did okay. Yeah. We left the bones with a bit of meat, but that's all bones. Yeah, we're gonna take this part too. There's some, some meat, meat there. there. We'll take. Nice. What are you doing there, Buzzy? Trying some lemons. Because Brady and Max lost quite a fish. Pretty sure it's a snapper of some sort. And we got some limes. It was all on top of them. And some couscous. And some cooked veggies. Mix it all together. It's gonna to be a feast. I'm really high, I just did some like Pilates. Pilates? Yeah. Gonna get the peachy butt. Peachy butt? Peachy butt? Peachy butt? Yeah, it's coming. Right. We just spent the past 20 minutes talking about how good it is to make shit money but work in places that have food. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like the sandwiches Max was just describing to me. Yeah, I worked in a cafe once. Yeah, good stuff. Yeah. Good stuff. Like, bro, I oh, dude, I just described to him a, a Cuban sandwich. And I just yeah. counter. <laughs> the counter described. He described a Some sandwich, sandwich in Sydney. Like yeah, aloumi and mm. roasted goodness. Yeah. Good More importantly, how's the fish? Uh oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh man, it's looking pretty good, man. Yeah. What are you doing, Yosh? Last dive tank full. And then I'm gonna eat! Mm -hmm. Thank you, Bubs. Thank you, Max. Thank you, Brady. Yeah. Oh, it's real good. Mm. Me and Max just woke up and <laughs> we came out onto the deck and the cockpit and it's all black everywhere because of the lava and it's worse than yesterday. Look at that. So much stuff. And look at the windows. It's all black. Wow. Can't see anything. Can I get a comment? <laughs> I can't see where we're going. <laughs> oh man, we gotta get out of here, guys. <laughs> Everything has been destroyed by the volcano. It's hot, there's no wind, and we can't sit outside. We can't open the hatches. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> I think we need to go. During the night, the breeze had shifted slightly, just enough to blow the plume of volcanic ash directly onto Delos, instead of the other direction. 
We were having fun with it though, and Frida decided to do a little spontaneous volcano art. Hey bro, let's get the anger up, man. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah. Because every time we clean something, more ash just comes down. <laughs> so we've got to get out. We've got to go to sea where it's clean it and there's no ash. All right, take them up, anger. The boat looks way cleaner though. Oh, look at it's everywhere still. I know. This is what we're running away from. Check it out. Next, we explore the town of Mayabundar, set sail for Interview Island, and have a crazy hot fishing streak. Oh, now you're coming. <laughs> Look at that serious face. <laughs> Everyone looks like a vampire in this light. You look really freaky. Yeah. Look at Brian up here. Yeah, where's Brian? <laughs> We've been Brian's climbing the volcano to try and get our camera back. <laughs> hey, mountain man! I can't even see him. He's behind the box now. <laughs> 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 I'm doing a filming I'm pressing. <laughs> <laughs> I saw those in there, you know. <laughs> He's out there. It's a good moves. One would probably be things that we've done when we're here, like outside. This is quite a big one. Rip it. But I've got to keep the 